Hello and welcome. Thank you for checking out this video. For people who are just visiting my channel, I am Rochelle, the DIY Affiliate, and I give you the knowledge to build a greater internet presence and make an impact with online video. Today's video is about buying subscriptions and how to use the new DIY Sub for Sub program to grow your channel. So, let's get started. What we are talking about today is called Sub Pals. This is where it can be found, www.subpals.com. You register, you'll receive a, an email and in the email it'll have all your information. You come back and you log in. You put your YouTube channel ID and if you don't know where to find your ID, you click here. It'll take you to your advanced settings and then you will be able to find either your channel URL or your channel ID. I have mine here, so in. You will then see members area. Your account will be banned if you unsubscribe for channels after earning them and all subscribers we delivered will be removed. So you see this pop-up window here. This is where you will like and subscribe to a channel. However, my first tip is if you are using this type of service is to choose who you like and subscribe to. A pop-up window will come up. This will take you right into YouTube. Make the window bigger. Again, we're looking at the thumbnails. This looks like it is a gaming channel, so I am going to click into it. This is where you will need to get the Social Blade browser extension. This will give you information about the channel. The subs in the last 30 days the views in the last 30 days, the daily sub average, the daily view average, subs today and views today. And they don't have any information. So pretty much this tells me that this is a brand new channel. And there is a possibility that people who start new channels and who put their videos on places such as Subpals 
sometimes don't build their channels. And if I subscribe to this channel, so I'm going to take a chance. I'm going to like and subscribe. but I'm also going to leave a message. And that is my number two tip, is to always leave a comment. This will help you to increase your digital footprint. So leave the comment, channel, to grow online, okay? So this is what I've said. I have liked this video and I've subscribed to your channel. I believe sharing knowledge is free and we can all work together to grow online. And then copy this rather than having to type it out in all of the videos that you like and subscribe to. So. Then when you are done, click confirm. And then again, check the thumbnail out. If it's something that looks interesting to you, then click into it. If it doesn't look interesting to you, then... So this way you can actually choose the channels that you would like to subscribe to. And you're not just clicking the like and subscribe, going like and subscribe, next, like and subscribe, next because you are not doing any favors for your own channel. So as you can see, it says someone from Greece has purchased 100 YouTube subscribers. So when they purchase 100 YouTube subscribers, that is where you see these videos here that are coming up. That is what they're selling. They're selling your likes and your subscriptions. We're just going to skip that. Okay, so you do have to be choosy. You have to make sure that, number one, you like the video. And if you are going to subscribe to the channel, you have to. And it doesn't take that much longer than actually going in here and doing like and subscribe and not really caring about the video or the channel that you're subscribing to. I'm so now I am going to show you how the DIY program, that I am going to show you how the new DIY sub for sub program works. So I'm going to go over to my YouTube. Okay. Now you see here it says sub for sub leave a comment. All of these channels here and I'm just going to go into my actual channels to show you. so these are my sub for sub leave a comment channels and all of these channels are growing YouTube channels
and they have agreed for when people go there and they leave them the comment that they have liked the video, subscribed to their channel, and that they believe that sharing knowledge is free and we can work together and grow our channels together. So these channels have all agreed to this. When you join the DIY Sub for Sub program, I add your channel here. I also add your channel in which you can become a collaborator on a playlist that I put out daily. Does Sub for Sub work the D Apple that are involved in the program? And you will know that you are going to get these subs. So here we have 21 videos and 20 of these videos are new channels. And I am updating this every single day. So you know that when you become a member, you will be getting the the subs and you will not be compromising your channel you will not be downgrading your channel be so what I do is the people that I leave comments to when they leave comments back to me I'm just going into my notifications right now. You could see this creates engagement. This person said thanks. This person says your comment got a heart. This person says someone liked your comment. This is all from the same video. And this is all engagement and associations that I am creating. So, as soon as I get a reply back, I will... Okay, so there we are at the channel. Here we are at the channel. Okay, so this is how the program works. The people that I leave the comments to and I like and subscribe to their channel, when I get a notification back from them, it shows me, yes, they are attentive, they're serious about building their channel, and from what they say, replied thanks, your comment got a heart, someone liked your comment, and I then go to the channel,
find a video that I like. Click on the like button because this now creates an association and helps to a link this channel to your channel. And of course, I've already subscribed. A type out a comment and then in the reply box I put this information I would like to add your channel into my sub for sub program are you willing to subscribe back to somebody who leaves you the following message I have liked a video and have subscribed to your channel to help you to grow and then I also say This will then increase your engagement and also let YouTube know that you have actually liked something on the channel and you are not just subscribing to subscribe back because that type of subscribing does not work. And then I insert the reply. Now the reason I haven't, in, I, and then I, so. I've already replied, so this is what it will look like. Now this will then give you now this will then show me how serious this person is. Do they want to become part of the uh, sub for sub program? Or, now it will also allow other people to see this and they may also reply back with this information. So this is how the new DIY Sub for Sub program works. A robot. I check out every single channel to see if it fits into the DIY sub for sub program model. And I have already left the message. They've left me a comment. Now I am going back and going to ask them if they would like to become a member of the DIY new sub for sub program. And this is how the program works. It takes a little bit more time, but it is worth it in the long run to be able to choose who your subscribers are. I cannot guarantee that everyone that you subscribe to will subscribe to you back. Not everyone believes that sharing their time and knowledge to help other people grow their business or channel online is the right thing to do. However, the DIY Sub for Sub program will help you find people who are serious about building their channel on a solid foundation and will want to work with you and build their channel with you together. YouTube wants to make money off your channel, so they give you all the information and tools that you need. YouTube is 70% of all traffic and your organic reach is 30% that there are ways of buying subscriptions, likes, and views. But YouTube also knows that you cannot buy 4,000 watch time hours. It needs to be earned. 
When you go to a subscription exchange network such as Subhouse, were your likes and subscribers are given to you in exchange for you selling your Okay, so say you go to a company like Subhouse and you buy 20 subscriptions a day. So that is 100 a week and over 400 in a month. So yes, your subscriber base is going up, but is the quality of your channel going up? So now what happens when you decide that you don't want to buy the subscriptions anymore and you don't have the same amount of people subscribing to your channel on a daily basis? Well, the boxes that I showed you from that come from Social, Social Blade are public and all the information is public. So a public information is free. YouTube does have this information as well. And they will go and they will check out all the channels that have subscribed to your channel within a certain period of time. And then if they find any channels that have been removed or If they find any channels that are in, inactive or have been closed, they will be deleted from your subscriptions because the channel no longer exists. These are called dead channels. I have put together this program that I call the DIY Sub for Sub program for my loyal subscribers to be able to help them to have the knowledge so that they can help themselves and help their subscribers as well to be able to get to grow a greater online presence. So I encourage you to join the DIY Sub for Sub program. And all the information that I share and the knowledge that I share has helped me to build my channel. To help you learn the DIY sub for sub program so you can share it with your subscribers and everybody can work together and build a community of like-minded people who are willing and able to help each other grow online. This is Rochelle, the DIY affiliate, wishing you Good luck. Build a greater online presence and make an impact with online video. Have a wonderful day.